so it's getting to be fall time here. The leaves are starting to change color. So we've got a lot of projects that we are working on trying to get done before winter. And it's been uh, quite difficult to get them done because Cole has been working a lot and he hasn't had a lot of days off. So I've been trying to do as much as I can by myself. But of course, it's a little bit difficult when you have a toddler. I just finished uh, feeding the pigs here. So they're having their uh, breakfast. And then after I finish doing the chores, I'm going to build them another electric fence pen over here. They've been doing a good job at clearing. This is where they haven't been. And then towards the house, that's where they have been back there. So they've been getting a really good job of clearing the grass and the willows that have grown up. We had it mulched over here last summer. And we had a lot of these trees come back up and the pigs have been doing a great job of clearing those. But yeah, uh, yesterday we were really busy. We cleared a bunch of land in preparation for building our new pig pens. We're putting in some permanent pens for the pigs for winter time and for next summer when we have babies. So we built, or we're going to build, sorry, a boar pen, a big sow pen and a farrowing pen and they're gonna have their own shelters. So we've gotta get that done. And a whole bunch of Our to-do list is still long. I went and picked a bunch of apples at my friend's house the other day. And I've been rationing to them to the pigs. And they just love apples. So I'm gonna give them some apples this morning. This is all the land that we just finished clearing the other day. move the pigs to new pasture. I try to move them every three to nine days depending on how big I make their pen. So it was time for them to move. They're quite content. As always, thanks for tuning in. Please like and subscribe and we'll catch you next time.